Welcome to the Autori Combi 95 amp alternator installation video. This is our number one video which covers uh, the first part when one receives the alternator and then the last part when one has to wire the alternator into the car. So when one receives the alternator it comes like this uh, with bolts installed and this is the upper bolt and the washers. Let's remove that prior to installation and also the lower bolt and of course that has to be removed as well before we install it. We are not going to cover the actual installation into the car because it's pretty straightforward. Just remove the upper alternator bracket, remove the old alternator and then install this alternator with this bolt, uh, tighten the bolt and that's where video number two is going to take over. And now we are going to cover once the alternator is in the car how to wire it. We receive a lot of questions about this. This is how the alternator uh, is, uh, comes, usually with the wiring harness already installed. If by any chance it's not installed, this is how it installs. It's pretty straightforward. Each of the conductors really have only one place to go. And what's loose is this uh, male conductor, which will connect to the car's harness. What's on the car is uh, one harness that comes from the starter. We actually sell uh, this short harness for Spider 2000 and this connects uh, to the stud terminal that has a 10 millimeter nut on it like that and also from the car's wiring harness we have another ring terminal and then a female terminal that goes to the alternator light on the dash and of course the ring terminal goes on the stud we just put the nut on it and uh, tighten it with a wrench and then the female and the male terminal for the light just get uh, plugged together and that's it the wiring is done